Now, Money Matters this morning, Tesla announces fully self-driving cars and Wall Street reacting to last night's president, presidential debate. Jane King's joining us now live at the NASDAQ with those stories and more in this morning's Money Matters report. Good morning to you, Jane. So Wall Street didn't hear much new, certainly from the presidential candidates, about the economy last night. No, Nikki and Jen, kind of the same old, same old stuff. So a reaction with a kind of a shrug, a yawn here today. So here's kind of a summarization. Uh, Democrat Hillary Clinton said she would grow the economy by focusing on the middle class and building the largest job creation program since World War II. She said she wants to create new clean energy jobs that would also help the environment. Now, Republican Donald Trump said he would cut taxes and criticize the current trade deals like NAFTA and said he would renegotiate them to get better terms or leave them all together. Jane, oil prices jumped to really the highest level in months. In 15 months. So we saw a surprise drop in U.S. inventories of oil. So that gave a boost. And also there's this thinking that OPEC is going to cut production as well at some point. So we saw oil uh, to the highest level in about a year and a half. West Texas Intermediate, close to $52 a barrel. So it hasn't been at that level since July 2015. Gas prices have been rising and will likely head higher, especially after this latest uh, push uh, higher this week. Unfortunately, it's never good news, certainly for us drivers, without a doubt, Jane. So what's this, uh, Jane, about the government warning about a popular Halloween uh, accessory? Well, you know those crazy contact lenses. The Federal Trade Commission has issued a warning not to buy these scary or cool-looking contact lenses without a prescription. So these are really popular right around Halloween. You can turn your eyes into cat eyes or bloodshot eyes. There's all kinds of just unbelievable stuff you can do with these lenses. But the FTC says there are some companies without medical licenses selling them, and they could damage your eyes. Ooh, They're and your eyes, after all. Gotta yeah, be I mean, yeah. you know, really, you have to be very careful with that. So I know this was a little overshadowed by the debate, but Tesla had a big announcement last night. <laughs> They did. This is what they were supposed to talk about Monday. Remember, they delayed it to Wednesday. Tesla says its electric cars will be the first in the nation to all be fitted with hardware to drive themselves. The automaker's Model S, X, and the forthcoming Model 3 sedan will start being outfitted with what they need for full self-driving capability at a safety level substantially greater than a human driver, according to the company. So, didn't hear a timetable on that, but that was what the big announcement was this week. Thank you, Jane. Have a good Thursday. Appreciate okay. it.